once I learned this about Disney movies, I never saw them the same. So back when Disney Studios was developing more live-action films in the 50s and 60s, getting a script by Walt Disney was no small feat. But screenwriter and producer Bill Walsh had a secret formula to get his scripts approved, and that was to stick a little Walt into the main character. So for Blackbeard's ghost, Blackbeard had Walt characteristics. The same went for the father in Shaggy Dog in 1959, and also the professor in Absent-Minded Professor in 1961. But Bill Walsh also did this for one of the most iconic movies of all time, and that was The Father in Mary Poppins. You see, the father was almost non-existent in the actual story, but Bill Walsh made him a main character, an important character, with the storyline of him with his two kids. As Bill Walsh put it, he made the father, George W. Banks, a great deal like Walt. And Walt loved it, so much so that he didn't care what P.L. Travers thought, he simply said, I like it and that's the way we're going to do it.